Byron. And a big run for Bowman on the outside. They're going to split Truex, and it's three Hendrick Chevys to the front. Just like much of the day, around goes Almendinger, back of the pack, four or five cars spinning. We stay green as everybody gets out of the throttle. Here they come to the flag. Ooh. William Byron will lead his 175th lap of the day and take the checkered flag in Las Vegas. Unbelievable. Yeah. Hard break for the Kyle Larson gang, I'm telling you. That 24 on both stages was a fast car. Fun way to end. Fifth career win for Byron in his 183rd start. Last April at Martinsville, the last time he'd been to Victory Lane. First three cars are basically who was first first three cars the entire day today. So it was pretty representative of the race today. And honestly, I said it earlier. It was going to come down to whoever was in front at the end, and that's who won the race. Look at Bubba Wallace, fourth place. Awesome day for him. Any one of those three could have won. It was his day. Austin-centric for uh, six. That's pretty good. Restarted ninth, Cindric up for sixth, Christopher Bell restarted tenth, finished fifth, Ham Wallace thirteenth, finished fourth. Hamlin's the one that really lost on that deal, didn't even finish in the top ten. And Truex, who was the leader at the restart, crosses the line, seven. Burning it down. <laughs> I cannot believe what I just saw. Did not see that caution coming out whatsoever. Neither did that guy. Man, Kyle's going to be so bummed. Heartbroken. Oh, so close. It was in his reach. Two to go. Oh, man. Charlotte, North Carolina's William Byron started playing racing on computer games. Told his dad, I'd like to give this a try. They went legends car racing on Tuesday nights at Charlotte. Then late models. Worked quickly through the truck series, the Xfinity series, and Rick Hendrick put him in a cup car. And here he is in victory lane for the fifth time. Hard to imagine that dream really started on a computer huh? racing simulation. That's true. That's just a product of this day and age, right? There's so much more computer games and there's so much more <laughs> realistic, but... Yeah, I that guess. Is, that's an interesting transition <laughs> to go is, from using your fingers on a, on, a, on a remote to uh, driving the actual car. And it is the third 1-2-3 finish for Hendrick Motorsports in the Cup Series. Jamie Little. William Byron absolutely dominated the day, swept the stages, gets the win. I know a lot of people look at this first mile and a half track to look forward to the rest of the season. What did that performance say to you, this team, and your fans? Yeah, I've just been really confident about it, the group of guys that I have on this 24 team. Uh, they work extremely hard, and we spent a lot of time in the offseason just going through, you know, running at the, the sim with Chevy and, and running on iRacing and just uh, trying to get better as a race car driver and as a team. So uh, it's all about the team. So it's a great pit crew. Uh, thinking of Chase back home. Wish he was out here with us. Um, he was a great race car driver, great teammate. So uh, wish he was out here, but uh, thankful to Mr. H, Jeff Gordon. I know he's watching, and uh, this RaptorTuff.com Chevy was was awesome i mean honestly when we got back in traffic it was a little bit tight but uh we knew we we knew we had speed so we just had to have the right things play out and, and rudy made a good call so it was good great battle with your teammate kyle larson and then you guys decide to come down and pit you mentioned your pit crew they were lights out all day what do you have to say about them and that call to come down and take two yeah honestly I, the one pit stop that they had that that we lost the lead uh i slid through the box or slid long and uh that delays the stop so that was on me and i knew they could get it done at the end and Rudy's been under the weather all day. He's got the you know stomach bugs. <laughs> He's been really quiet on the radio, but uh, luckily it worked out there. And uh, just thanks to all the fans for coming out. Uh, always love racing in Vegas, how you move around, and excited for the year. All right, William Byron, your winner in Las Vegas.